What you're about to see is a three-dimensional simulation of breast augmentation surgery. I've been doing breast augmentation since 1985 and I've done thousands of them and I'm always getting the question, what is it going to look like? Well now we can give you a sense of what it's going to look like. The first step is to stand in front of the camera. The camera consists of three heads. Each of the heads has a white light, a very high resolution, medical grade, digital camera, and a projector. Each of the projectors shines a series of color lines on your body. By acquiring images of the color lines from different directions, the computer can determine the contour of your body and reconstruct that image. Actually taking the three-dimensional picture is easy. Just stand in front of the camera. We then line you up with each of the high-resolution digital cameras that are in the three heads. Then I push the acquire button and in about two seconds the computer is able to get all of the pictures that it needs to be able to construct the three-dimensional model. Of course it takes a minute or two to actually do the calculations to produce that. Once the computer has finished creating the model you can see how the breast looks from different directions. The photographs will be taken either with a bra or without a bra. A bra is very helpful if the breasts are a little bit droopy. Next we mark the various parts of the breast so the computer can use that for its calculations. First we mark the outer part of the breast, then the crease underneath the breast. Now we mark the nipple, and we mark the edge of the areola, which is the darker tissue around the nipple, and then the inner part of the breast. Then we mark what's called the sternal notch at the upper part of the sternum, and then the same spots on the left side. Now we want to check our marks, look at them from different directions to make sure they're all in about the right position. The computer will use these marks to determine where the breast itself is, and based on that, where it should place the breast implant. One of the advantages of building a three-dimensional model of the breast is it lets us take some very accurate measurements of the breast. Here you can see the computer has determined the base width of the breast, which is the width of the breast at its base on both sides it does a calculation and determines the width is 16.9 centimeters. We can use that information when we're actually picking the implant. Also notice that the computer produces an estimate of the difference in size of the breasts. In this case, the computer estimates that the right breast is 40.3 cubic centimeters greater in volume or larger than the left. Now, with the breast outlined and the measurements checked, we can simulate the actual breast augmentation. Here I'm going to tell the computer to simulate a 500cc implant on both sides. We click the update button and there you can see the difference. It's also possible to look at the patient before and after the simulated breast augmentation on both sides, turning both torsos together. Patients find this to be a very useful view to get an idea of the breast augmentation size that they're looking for. We often ask the patients how they feel about this process and whether being able to see the breast augmentation in three dimensions is helpful for them and uniformly they tell us that it is. I thought it was awesome. It gave me an opportunity to see what the results would be rather than have to wonder and it was quick, it was easy and Dr. Nakbar made it a great experience. I breastfed two children and it changed the way my body looks and I have been thinking about it for a long time and would like to have it the way it used to be. And so this gave me an opportunity to not just have to wonder but to see it and help me make my decision. And that's it. It's simple, it's quick, and it gives you a real three-dimensional view of the breast. For more information, please go to our website at plastic.org. We have lots of information and you can watch video interviews of patients describing how plastic surgery has improved their lives. We have hundreds of before and after pictures and you can also look at patient questionnaires from our patients. If you call my office at 480-289-5300, my friendly staff will be happy to answer your questions. They can also set up a complimentary consultation so we can meet and we can do your own three-dimensional breast simulation. You can also schedule your consult online at our website 24-7. We look forward to meeting you.